hey guys back with another video so this is part two of my watercolor method video and this video is just going to be you know just the regular styling of the hair and so forth so right now i'm just gonna um mold it um i'm just gonna put some uh, mousse on top um it's just styling mousse it's not the one that I use for my baby hairs. I use a separate one for my baby hairs and a separate one for molding. But sometimes the one that's for molding, well, the, the one that's for the baby hair, sometimes it really don't stick. So I sometimes I do use the uh, molding one and sometimes I don't. But both is good. I really don't have a problem with it. Um. So, yeah, like I said, right now all I'm doing is molding and that's pretty much it for right now. So right now I'm using my trusty um, argan oil and then I'm going to go ahead and use my um, my other products that I always say I use. The new product that I've been using, it's been going pretty good and it's pretty, it's a good smell. So I've been using it and it's pretty good though. Um, I'm kind of running out of the argan oil because I've just been going ham with it. But yeah, I use the Shea Sleek um spray it has a mix of argan oil and a heat protectant so it's going good so far so um what i'm gonna do is just use my remington flat iron to flat iron um flat iron the hair and that's pretty much it but like i said or like i'm about to say the video is mostly going to do the talking for me so i really don't have to really talk for this video unless you know what i'm saying you know a little couple of stuff but i'm gonna just let you guys watch and enjoy So you already know what's about to happen here. I'm going to just use my handy dandy hot comb and do the old, the method I always tell you guys to do. Comb through and then after you um, go ahead and leave your finger on there for a second because it is hot. So I don't recommend putting on for no like seconds, but you go ahead and put on there for just one second and then just let it run through. I'm about to show you guys one more time. And there it is. And you want to do it more than once. You just don't want to do it um, one time. You want to do it more than once. So you want to make sure your the hair is pressed out. Ooh, look at that. 
Yes, so you want to make sure the hair is pressed out. Just don't do it in the front. Also, do it in the back because the back is now also pressed out. You want to do it on the whole closure. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. So after I hot comb the one part, I always go in my Edge Booster Wax Stick. And I just go in there and um, go in there and put it on where I hot combed and the rest well, on top of the closure where I hot combed at. And this makes, I put it on the um, part where I hot comb, like in the front, because it makes the um the front more defined instead of putting like oil and stuff and they get rid of the flyaways so it makes it more defined than what it already you know is tend to be in which it looks bomb like i love using the like i love the hot comb and then you know going ahead and um i'm on the phone guys that's why you see me laughing and stuff so um yeah so it just makes it more defined and what it is. But look at that part though. Come on. That part looks so good. And then like I just love the color because the color makes it makes everything just stands out even more. So oh my god. Just just keep watching guys.
you already know I had to do a close-up for this. So you're going to go ahead and do that. Comb it out. Place your fingers where you left and do it and just keep doing it until you get to your desired um, look. And then you want it looking symmetrical on both sides. So, um, yeah, just keep doing it until you get it to where you want it. And then you follow up with that with a wax stick. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you liked it. I really like this wig. This wig is one of my signature ones because I really like this. So like this video 
and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you guys watching every hair video, every video that I post. Thank you guys.